Hi there, Eric Backer here again with another frequently asked question regarding yeast infection. This is a question from Rick in Colorado. Eric, what is the recovery time in Candida? What is a normal time somebody recovers from a uh, chronic yeast infection? Well, Rick, to answer that question, uh, I'd have to say to you, how long have you had this thing for? What are your expectations of recovery? Have you had this this thing for a year or two years? It looks like Rick's had jock itch and toenail fungus, so I've got no real idea how long you've had this for, Rick, but let's just say you've had it maybe for five or ten years. Well, the recovery time really depends on a lot of factors, but it depends particularly on, on how you apply yourself towards the recovery. What measures are you taking? Are you treating this thing locally, systemically? Are you looking at your lifestyle and diet? Or are you just expecting supplements to, to do the curing for you? Are you using a combination of pharmaceutical uh, uh, drugs, you know, antifungal creams or pills? And uh, do you keep on drinking alcohol when you do this? Surprising how many guys do this when I see them. They'll keep drinking beer and having pizzas, but then take a few pills and expect to get rid of it. Well, in that case, the recovery could be protracted. It could take a long time. So how long does it take someone to do a PhD? How long does it take someone to pay off a mortgage? How long does it someone to do anything worthwhile in life? It all depends on the ability of that person to be enthusiastic about wanting to get the, the outcome, the result they're looking for. It depends on that person's ability to apply themselves to get the results they're looking for. So if you apply yourself earnestly and follow the advice I'm giving in my book, Candida Crusher, you can nail this thing within 12 months. If you've had it for 10 years, I'd expect a 12 months resolution. Anyone who tells you you can cure this thing, uh, Rick, in, in 12 months, uh, you know, is going to be close to the mark. But if someone tells you you can cure jock itch in 12 hours, well, you need to walk past these turkeys because, you know, there's a lot of these people out there that make these stupid statements. Just like I get spam, you know, emails in my inbox saying I can, uh, you know, there's a $126 million check for me to pick up you know, whatever, some nonsense like this, you know. If you believe in this this sort of nonsense, well, you know, there's no hope for you, but I don't think you're that type of person. So you can recover, and your ability to recover is dependent on how you apply yourself, you know, with uh, well-defined principles and a good program. And if everything works out well and you do things properly, within one year, well and truly, you'll have this thing completely cleared up. But not only that, you probably will have lost some weight in the interim, your probably sleep will have improved, and you will have, you will have gained a considerable improvement in your health and well-being uh, overall. So I hope that answers your question, Rick. Thanks for your question.